A Springfield police officer is recovering after an arson suspect stabbed him Wednesday night, but his equipment saved his life. 22 News reporter Sydney Snow is live at the Springfield Police Headquarters with the new information on this case. Acting Springfield Police Commissioner Cheryl Clapperud gave a news, held a news conference this afternoon to give an update on the officer's condition. The suspect was identified as 39-year-old Ruben Barrero and the officer as Greg Vetrano. Clapperud said the two became engaged in a violent struggle on Island Pond Road after Barrero intentionally set his Vermont Street home on fire and ran away. Barrero allegedly stabbed Vetrano in the chest with a kitchen knife. The knife went through Vetrano's shirt and vest but did not penetrate his skin due to to the trauma plate located inside his bulletproof vest. The hit to the chest was so loud he heard it from a little bit of ways. Um, the two began to struggle violently on the ground with Mr. Barrero on top of Officer Vetrano. He was delivering blows to the officer's head and body. Clapperud said Vetrano suffered a broken hand and cuts and bruises, but is home recovering. Barrero was held without bail after a judge entered not guilty pleas on his behalf to charges including attempted murder and arson. He's scheduled to undergo a mental health evaluation. In Springfield, Sydney Snow, 22 News.